Okay guys, we're just gonna start off at the door and this is the little shoe organizer that we have right here for all of Mason's shoes. And that's the little dream catcher that we got from Babies or Russ. And if you pan this way, you will see Mason's bed. And right there, we just have a Dollar Tree bin filled with all his little plush animals. This is his bed. The bed came from Walmart and the bedding came from, uh, the pillow came from Target. Babies are Russ, Big Lies, and his plush animals right here were just gifted to him. That's his little M for Mason. It came from Hobby Lobby. These are their blackout curtains right here. All three came from Walmart. And down here we just have a pillow that we got. I actually thrifted the pillow. And the teddy bear came from Walmart. And I just have a faux fur rug right there from Hobby Lobby as well. And it makes me feel like it just divides their room. I don't know it could just be me <laughs> but right here I have a little DIY dream catcher mobile whatever it is you want to call it but I made it for Bryson when he was a when he was born and he has a bee over his bed from Hobby Lobby as well and this is his bed it came from Walmart his blanket came from Babies or Rust and it just has like a little Aztec design on it that's his little praying bear from Walmart his little owl night light is so cute and here we have just his little diaper organizer with the diaper wipes you know pacifier clips and stuff like that just quick little things you need on a daily basis nothing on the wall right there and that's just a little drawing that his big brother draw drew for him when he was first born and it says dear Bryson I will take care of you that's their closet, but I'll get back to that. That's their little bear organizer that holds some of the socks and bibs and stuff. And this is my favorite part of the room right here. The cubicle is a little worn down, but it gets the job done. And it comes from Walmart, and it just stores his shoes, his little toys, his bath necessities, and, you know, like his little trinkets and stuff. Everything from up here came from Hobby Lobby, except for the lamp. I believe the lamp came from Target. And that's Mason's little book bag right there. I got that from the Goodwill for three bucks. Yes, he loves Dora the Explorer and it is just so cute. I thought that was a total steal. But this is Bryson's little activity center right here. And I'll go back to the closet. That's supposed to be over the window, but it fell and I never hung it back up. Now their closet is not that organized and not that neat, but I'll show it to you anyways. Here is Bryson's side. That is Mason's side. And down there, I just have clothes that Bryson hasn't grown into quite yet. And that stuff he's grown out of and I need to donate it. And I usually put his clothes that he's going to wear throughout the week in that being right there. And this down here just stores his onesies, his pants, and down here is just like all his extra bath and hygiene products, you know, typical baby stuff. That's where that is. And up here I have his breathing treatment in this little bin right here. And up here is just like heavy duty jackets and hats and stuff like that for when it's cold. But we're from the south and it doesn't get that cold down here. And up here is just extra shoes and clothes that he can't fit until he's a big boy and I just have it stored up there in old diaper boxes I mean why not use them I paid for them and those are just extra diapers right there but yep that's their little closet nothing fancy <clears throat> alrighty and this is Bryson's side he's nine months old and Mason's side, he's three years old and they share this room even though Mason basically sleeps with his brothers. That's where all his toys are. That's why you don't see that much going on in here. It's basically just minimal kid stuff in here because all of the toys are in the big boys room. That is all guys. Hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching.